Are you ready to take a step back in time and experience the nostalgia of EverQuest on the Project 1999 emulator, but wouldn't mind some sprucing up of the game's textures? Well, you're in luck. In today's video, I'll take you through the process step by step of installing the P99 EQ Classic HD Texture Pack. Don't worry, even if you're not a tech savvy gnome, I've got your back. I'll guide you through the installation process from start to finish. So let's go. First, go to the folder that you installed your original P99 folder in and make a copy. I renamed mine P99-EQ underscore classic underscore HD. Next, go to the Project 1999 Wiki website at wiki.project1999.com slash EQ underscore classic underscore HD. Click download in the content area to bring you further down the page. Choose the Project 1999 version zip file EQ Classic HD P99.zip. Next, you'll download and unpack the file to a location of your choice. By default, Chrome places the file in your downloads folder. I chose to create a P99 folder in my downloads. Now you will unzip the new downloaded file. I chose the Extract to EQ Classic HD option. Then go into the folder of the file you just extracted. Find the install.bat file, then double click or right click and select open. When it asks you to select your EverQuest folder, choose to install it in the copy you made in step one. The last step is to create a desktop icon to run the game. Click into your new P99 EQ Classic HD folder and find the everquest.bat file Right click, send to, desktop create shortcut. To change the look of your new shortcut, find it on your desktop, right click, properties, change icon, browse to the P99 EQ Classic HD folder, find the everquest.ico file, hit open, hit okay, then apply, OK again, and now you have a schnazzy new EQ icon. And that's a wrap. Congratulations on successfully installing the P99 EQ Classic HD Texture Pack. I hope this tutorial has breathed new life into your classic EverQuest experience, immersing you in a world of stunning visuals and nostalgic charm. If you found this tutorial helpful, be sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more old school MMO content and helpful tutorials. Take care.